What is this? This one? Uh, that's a microscopic picture of the film of a hologram, which in fact I made up myself with a Microsoft Paint, so it's a fake. But it's about what it would look like. It's about what, if you look through the microscope at the film, not the thing that is being described by the hologram, but by the piece of film itself, it would look approximately like that. And uh, so then if you put light no. through it in some okay. particular way. Right, well, let's, let's first. It's got some information in it. It's all yep. scrambled. It's impossibly yep. scrambled. You can't look at this and see what, the, what it is. Anybody, any guesses what the, yeah. the image guesses? is there? Anybody want to guess? <laughs> what? Leonard Susskind. Leonard Susskind. Oh, uh, it's good. Donald Rumsfeld. Guess down here. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, great. So it is, it is a fake. Uh, uh, anyone say puppy? Anyone say puppy? Little horsey? Mm -hmm. uh, no, no horses. Okay, okay, all right. Let's see. Well, okay, go no, to the this, next this, one. Let's go, go to the next, next one. one. Here's here's the stand by, folks. All right. This is another fake. I also drew that myself. All right. All right. So if you do the right thing with a hologram, namely shine light on it and so forth. It'll reconstruct an image. So the, 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 you got the flashlight. Uh, yeah, yeah. Maybe this is obvious, but right. the flashlight going right. through the film, but, and somehow the, the yeah. information it, it, uh, t in the film recreates the 3D yeah. image of the clown smoking right. the cigar. But that's the, right, but the interesting thing about it is that the clown is three-dimensional. You can go behind it, and you can see whether he has hair on the back of his head. You can go underneath and look at the chin underneath. In fact, if this hologram had been made not with ordinary light, but if it had been made by uh, an NMR scan, you could have coded on that boundary, on that uh, surface, you could have the interior, you could have all your guts and blood and everything else, bones. The entire full three-dimensional structure would have been mapped. You used the word mapped, and it's a good word. Mapped onto the boundary, onto the film. Uh, and the important thing is not that you shine light to reconstruct it, but that the information about the clown is equally well, and in fact, in some sense, better described, more accurately described, more precisely described by the uh, little dots and dashes and uh, structures that are entirely scrambled, totally impossible for you to just look at, but it's there, it's there in that film. It's there.